The last day of in-person early voting could be a sign of what's to come on Tuesday here at Glendale Community College's North Campus. Some voters who cast their ballots just before 7 p.m. says they actually had to wait in line for over an hour and a half to do so. On Election Day, Maricopa County is expecting a turnout of anywhere between 300,000 and 400,000 in-person voters. When we pulled in the parking lot, it looked like it was a long line, which actually is a good thing to see. And we didn't have an option, so we, we got the back of the line. Between now and Tuesday, Clean Elections Executive Director Tom Collins says election workers, specifically in Maricopa County, will be putting on the finishing touches of preparation and opening all 246 vote centers. From on the administrator side, it's about deploying uh, all of these um, uh, vote centers and then you know having the vote and then getting all that uh, equipment and those ballots back right so this is really just it's it's it's, it's an incredibly complicated uh, logistical exercise there is emergency voting that is open until monday at 5 p.m. but that is only for people who experience some sort of emergency during that time frame that prevents them from voting on tuesday if you do emergency voting, voters will have to sign a sworn statement in that case as well that there is an emergency preventing them from voting on Election Day. And on Tuesday, the polls open at 6 a.m. and last until 7 p.m., but you only have to be in line by 7 p.m. to make sure that your vote counts. For now, reporting in Glendale, Zach Perlutsky for Arizona's Family. Thank you, Zach.